My name is Haisam Nawad. I'm an artist, designer, and a researcher. And I teach as well in the American University in Cairo and the German University in Cairo. Uh, I think that's enough. <laughs> I mean, frankly speaking, is is it will, of course because I am from the generation which really we started with uh, Arabic was not really completely uh, at all computerized, so it was really hard time for us to make a design using Arabic in computers. So for now, for me, it's heaven. Like what I was spending like weeks of trying to accomplish, it's I can do it now in two hours. So that doesn't mean that I'm really satisfied because I was wishing for more, but. Uh, uh, for for the non-Latin scripts, that actually what somebody call uh, complex scripts for me is not really complex because at least the Arabic and all languages are using the Arabic uh, type. But um, so for now, it's much better than before. But I will not actually say that it's actually all oriented to Latin. But I would say it needs a little little bit more improvement. I mean, my talk today was, it explains a lot about like in Arabic script, which is used again by more than one billion six hundred million and uh, uh, four hundred fifty million of them speaking the language. We we don't have. I mean, we, by you know, if I said uh, annually, we, we don't have typefaces. We don't we don't have, uh, and most of it actually it's produced either in London, Amsterdam, uh, Berlin. The only two initiatives, um, also at the Hague, and also still in the Netherlands. But uh, other than this, a very few individuals. They work in the Arab world. One or two in, in Lebanon, one and two in Cairo, um, and that's it. For one billion, uh, six hundred million, compared to the Chinese, it's it's insane. So, I think uh, for for my part, it needs really a lot of work. And uh, it's a big responsibility as a, as a teacher, but I cannot do everything alone. We always attach to an institution, and uh, we have to find a way during, uh, through the system of the institution. Uh, from a designer point of view, it's very important to, to learn about the culture before you design a typeface. Uh, I can give you examples some of them it was in Germany about some people that actually design using Arabic script in their own context because of not really understanding the culture. So uh, typefaces are like calligraphy is associated to certain topics. That's why we choose type from another type. And if you choose a kind of type which is comes from a religious uh, 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 country or a religious text, like some of the scripts, Arabic script, it's really mostly using religious script and then it comes that somebody have no clue about this culture and we like aesthetically he likes the way how it looks like the Arabic type okay I will use it for a t-shirt or a funny funky porn t-shirt and he traveled to one of these countries and it would be a disaster just because he didn't read uh, the manual before the community you have to study the culture and that's it it's our part as designer really to learn and then we transfer our knowledge to educate others because that's for the, the, the like if a native Arabic speaker designer or even an, a non-Arabic speaker uh, designer it needs a lot to of really learn and then when you learn it actually bridge all culture together we are the transporters I mean of course, we did discuss about the non-Latin, but um, you need a term that actually combines because um, there is many, I mean, the multilingual or the multiscript, which is, it, it's more than, I mean, academically correct, it's multiscript, not lingual. I'm not talking about languages, we look about, we talk about uh, the representation, the visual representation of a language. So we call it multiscript. Um, um, I think that's more appropriate for or equal, like, between uh, among the whole uh, different writing systems of the world. Uh, also the term universal, uh, it's also used for all kinds of, 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 of uh, script around the globe. So, but I, 
I like more of a multi, uh, multi-lingual. Oh, sorry, multi-script. <laughs>